Oh boy. This this is gonna be a doozy. Oh man. I don't know if I'm prepared for this. But we're this close to the end, I can't back out now. Uh, <laughs> uh. Getting flashbacks. Mm. I guess, better get started. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, we stand at the precipice. This close to the end, but what must we endure to get there? I don't know if I'm ready. We have to move forward. We must end this. Complete it properly. <sighs> that is our purpose here. We cannot escape it. And here we go. Scenario one. I want to point out, by the way, I was just checking this. Before we get started, I'm stalling now. The first four scenarios, these are like the intro scenarios to establish the scenario. I keep saying scenario. The plot and the characters. That's what this establishes. First of September. Next scenario takes place on the 8th, so seven days. Every subsequent scenario after that, for a while, is then eight days after the one before it. Until we get here. I don't know why that bothers me, but it does. Not quite a week. Doesn't seem to be any reason to it. Okay, rip the bandaid off, let's go. <clears throat> Scenario 1. Shion strikes. There's a new team at school. Side Zero. Soon, a strong... Terrible presence descends upon Boomski's classroom. <laughs> ping pong, ping pong. Oh, God, it's already starting. Oh, no. <laughs> Hello. Is everyone fantastic today? That beautiful voice! That beautiful face! That beautiful aura! You're the crown jewel of Gumbray High School! The face that could launch a thousand Gundams! Shion! Oh, what expression is good for this right now? The angry face? Not that face. No. Nope. Sad face. Shion. Oh god. I'm gonna keep that one. Ugh, yeah, I'm not happy. No. We're not even, like, placid here. We are... I'm upset. <gasps> That's me! Gumbray High School's very own superstar. Today is another day to bring smiles to every face I see. You monster. <sighs> I'm not. I can't. I, I just can't. I won't say this. This is the one line that I will not voice. I refuse. These characters can speak for themselves. He's... Poor, hapless fools. <laughs> the citizens of Shion are all smiles again today. But today I'm after something a little different. She's on the prowl. 
I heard that the leader of Side Zero was in class. You can't see it, but I'm sweating profusely. Out of terror and rage. <laughs> Maybe if you sit very still, she won't see you. God, I hope not. Hey, you! Sitting there quietly and staring at me. Yes, you! She belongs to the people. Don't get any ideas, teehee. I despise this character with every fiber of my being. Wait, are you Boomski? I'm Shion Daikuji. I'm so happy to meet you. I want to talk to you, but it can't be here. Come with me, okay? She's kidnapping me. I'm being kidnapped. Okay, no one will come here. You never know who might be listening in the classrooms or hallways. I don't know, witnesses? People who could help me, save me from this horrible fate? <sighs> so anyway, what I had to say was, I heard the rumor that you formed a team to fight against the, against the student council. I can speak. I'm so flustered. The truth is, I've been angry with the council lately too. They took away Gumpla Battle and smiles from my fans. I'll never forgive them. Uh, uh, I mean, she's basically just Yui, except entirely unbearable. So I thought, maybe if I teamed up with this Boomski, and that's why I came to see you today. Uh -huh. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Yeah. I want to combine our powers and fight together to take down the student council. Uh, uh, if only I got the choice. If only there was one choice in this game. All the other ones, I could forgive everything else in this game. If they gave me just one choice here to say no and to just end the story right there. That's all I ask. But no. There's no escaping this hell. But first, I need to make sure you're as strong as the rumors say you are. We'll just use this battle system, right? It's right there. I'll just borrow it for a bit. Hee <laughs> hee. All right. Time for a mission by Sh mission by Shion featuring Boomski. My God. Be more full of yourself, please. Oh God. I'm using the tall breaker for this one. I'm in no mood for bullshit. <laughs> uh. We're gonna get these missions done as quickly as possible. Minimize the pain. Ugh. All right. Is it a normal cooperative mission? Just gotta get through it, and then she'll leave. <laughs> Bright magenta gun. Ay -ay -ay. Oh, that's right, she starts calling me Captain. Ugh. Makes me feel dirty. Ugh. Oh, Captain, my Captain. I refuse to be her Captain. I refuse to stoop so low. Alright. Finish this quickly. 15, thank god it's not 20. Oops. If she kills these things faster than I can, that'd be fantastic actually. Do I like, huh? I'm not gonna tell her anything about me. I don't want her to know anything about who I am as a person. 
feel like that'd be a very bad idea. I missed. Kill the things, please. Target the right things. Okay, cool. Hashmall, why is it here? Ow. Ow. Whatever. Let's just go. Oh, no. My gun is. Ugh. Yikes. I'm going down already. Forget what that happened. Target the body, please. It's easier to hit. No. No. It switched and then switched back immediately. Oh, God. She's being possessive. I don't like it. Oof. Literally any other character, and I'd be okay with that. Even the teacher. No, it has to be Shion. There's gonna be a lot of just groaning and moaning from me. Ah, yeah. Come on! Shion, could you, you know, be useful, please? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Nope. I'd like to finish this, please. Let me finish! Who cares? Ouch! Just fight the boss, please! You're extending my pain, Xion. He's an actual devil. Oh my gosh, I'm dead already. What's happening? Oh my gosh, why did that take so long? Deal the final blow. Just do it. You you are so useless. Oh my god. It is one shot away. What even was that? There we go. <sighs> no. No! I refuse, I will not say it. See, normally I'd be okay. Even with this this design that she has here. But it's just boring. <sighs> we made it through one mission, just oh god, seven more. Whew. Boomski! Wow, wow! I'd expect nothing less from someone you and Iori approved. Your power just might be enough to make my dreams come true. It's all about you, isn't it? Ugh. Oops, did I say that out loud? <laughs> we'll have to talk later. We'll have that talk later. <sighs> I've been waiting for someone like you to appear for so long, someone I can manipulate. You and me, Boomski, together we're going to bring Gumpla Battles and Gumpla Smiles back to the school. For my sake, specifically. <sighs> no. No. <laughs> hey, say it with me. Why aren't you saying it with me? Because I hate you. Do, do you not want to team up with me? No, I don't. I don't, I really don't. I need to think about it a little bit, which I mean, no. As the superstar idol of Gumbrae High School, I want to fight with all my bravery and love and joy and bring Gumpla Battle equality back to our school. Good for you. Go do your best. We're going to do our own thing, okay? And I need your help to do it, so please, please fight with Shion, okay? 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 Okay, she just made that decision for me. Okay, now that means, Boomski, I hereby officially commission you as a captain in the Principality of Shion. Ugh! Ow, oh, it hurts. <laughs> I'll even allow you to paint your gumbler red. Never. 
I actually enjoy using red quite a bit when I'm painting miniatures, but I don't know that I've actually really used red to paint Gumpla before. Strike always for victory for Shion and the Principality, Captain. No! I fight for my friends and you're not one of them. <sighs> Scenario 2. The aftermath of Shion's live show. <laughs> Something big is going down and everybody is going... And everybody's going. Boomski gets cut up in the rush. Only to find dot 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 horror terror v ugh. anguish. Whoa, where's the fire? Where are they running to the auditorium? Uh, hey, don't just stand there. Didn't you hear? Shion is putting on a gorilla concert. What? Come on, let's go. Come on, Boomski. Don't you want to see this? No, I don't. I really don't. Let me leave. Uh, I'm not saying it. I refuse. Oh. You poor, poor fools. Keep this up and the Principality of Xion will be bigger than ever. Follow Xion, everybody. She's a manipulator. A master manipulator. Oh my god. I think that one speaks for itself. Just like that. Keep it up. Blow out your voices. Use all your energy to praise me. Alright, it's time for a song. Coming at you with Beyond the Time. Well, I'm not saying this either. I will not put lies in my mouth. Oh, jeez. Hey, no, you can't come on stage. That's against the rules. Security! That is actually not cool. I don't know about rules, and I don't care. I just can't take it anymore. You belong to me. Uh, no. Security! Hey, dude, cut it out, man. Uh, somebody help her. Uh... I don't like her, but that doesn't mean I want this to happen to her. So because I'm a good person, uh, ow! Uh, so sorry, um, I was uh, just a joke. Uh, I was um, just kidding. Uh, thank you, Boomski. Oops, I meant. I mean, thank you, Captain. <laughs> Sometimes the citizens of the Principality of Xi'an can get a little over-enthusiastic. But you'll always be there to protect me, won't you, Captain? No. I won't. This was a one-time thing. No more of that, okay? Xi'an belongs to everyone, and everyone belongs to Xi'an. Uh, uh, yeah, okay, Xi'an. As a special reward for my hard-working Captain, I'll show you Xi'an's favorite mission. Let's go to that club room. That club room? That's our club room. <sighs> this is the second time we've been here. It's like we're sneaking off to our own secret place. How exciting. How scandalous. No. I will not allow rumors like that to circulate. Ugh, there's nothing between us. There never will be. Are you ready? I'm starting the mission. Shion is ready for takeoff. Let's just get through it. If only I wasn't too nice to say no. Ugh. That's okay. It's just part of the plot. She's the main girl for this route. We have to go along with her overbearing everything. As much as I don't want to. Just like before, we just gotta get it done fast. <laughs> Ten containers. 
Do you have any other dialogue to say during a mission? My goodness. Ugh. It may seem like I'm unreasonably harsh on this character. And if I'm being honest, yeah, I am. I don't like her. In fact, I'd say I hate her. With a burning passion! Ugh. You might even say... That this hatred of mine bur shines with an awesome power. Ugh. Line up the shots. Or not. Okay, yeah. That's fantastic. Alright, we just have to complete the 15 target one again. Once we do that... Oh my god, is that... Are these things the only things here? This is an issue. Because when you ever have a... Whenever you have a destroy target mission... Those targets have higher health than your general, like, neutral units. Ugh. So the Destroy 15 Units mission inevitably takes longer, and that's the one you need to complete to unlock the boss. And to finish the actual... Come on. Ouch finish the actual mission. The quest itself. Ouch. Oops. Alright, where is it? Neo Xiong, where are you? It's not appeared yet. There it is. Go! Go! Ouch. Double ouch. Ugh. Oh my god, I'm missing every shot. Come on. Don't run to the blazer, please. Oh, jeez. Okay. Gun, gun, gun. Man, I am so glad that you can still do damage while they're... ...broken down. Jump up, please. Okay. That's bad. Okay. Keep shooting. Just keep hitting him. Are you doing any damage, Xion? Come on. Ugh. No. I refuse. Cares about any of that? Okie dokie. Mission number two down. Making progress. Fabulous, Captain. Amazing. You are moving even better than last time. Admissions at my concert. You protected me. That was an obligation. You were someone in trouble. I did, you know. Was it because it was you? The Principality of Xion needs you, Captain. I knew I wasn't wrong about you. Ugh. You could literally just recruit all of your fans and just tell them not to listen to the Council. Like, they have no actual power. They can't physically force you to follow their rules. 
will get stronger and stronger, realize the defeat of the student council, and win independence for the superior citizens of the Principality of Xi'an. Uh, that's not okay to say. No. We're going to do great things, Captain. She's now ignoring that I'm not following along with her. Moving at her own pace. She doesn't care about me or anything that I think. Anyway, scenario three. The Principality of Xi'an activated. The sun has barely set on the day of the concert, when yet another commotion grips the school. What do you mean? What do you mean? This one took place on the 16th. This one's taking place on the 24th. It's been eight days. Sun has barely set my butt. Hey, did you hear? Xion's gonna do something out in the field. Xion! We have to go right now! The front row will be mine! Hey, Boomski. Looks like all Side Zero supporters are off to the field. Shouldn't you go too? Ugh. I guess I don't have a choice. So as your superstar and a student of this school, I want to tell all of you a secret. It's not really a secret if you tell literally everybody. And that is, ever since the founding of Gumbra High School, the original student charter, though law thought lost, was actually being held in the principal's office. This is a cute reference. But I can't enjoy it, because it's Xion making it. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, what is that? Who knows? I'm just here to see Xion speak. <sighs> oh god, what should I do for Shogo now? I don't know if I can do a southern accent, like a cowboy accent, but I can try. Hey, hey, what's all this? I can't do it. It's gonna be terrible. You can't just go around having rallies. You got permission for this from the council, student council. I can try and speak. There can be no rules restricting free assembly in Gumbra High School, where the love of Gumpla rules. Yeah, that's right! Ah, uh, what? What even are you? You want to fight Shield of Laplace, is that it? Eek. Morita, if, you're having, if you have something to say, say it to us. Why are you here, Yui? Yuri as well. Why is everybody here? We won't allow you to, your bullying to go unpunished, you thug. You little... How dare you talk to an upperclassman that way? Well, Yui and that new kid, you're a nobody with no place to talk. But that's... Is she, though? I thought she was actually really good. Beloved citizens of the Principality of Xion, now is the time to rise up! Aid our comrades, Yui and the Ori of Side Zero! Oh god, they're gonna hurt him, aren't they? They're gonna... Mob him. Yeah! What the... Man, this is really annoying. I don't have time to deal with nobodies like you. Hey, General Sunshine, why don't you fight me yourself? We'll settle this with the Gumpla in the battle room. With the Gumpla in the battle room. The role of the leader is to stand and fight in the vanguard with their troops, all while reading two, three moves ahead. Shion accepts your challenge. It's a quick way to get yourself killed, lady, but... I guess I can't really complain. So what are you going to bet on this fight? I bet every part of my, I've ever lifted from another student. Match that. Okay, then. How about this? I vouch for five minutes of holding my hand. <laughs> Don't be stupid, as if I'd want that. Good man, Shogo. I got it. You're friends with Yui and those losers, right? If I win, you have to disband your team, and you and Yui have to dress up like Super Fumina and be my servants for a day. You're losing points, Shogo. I'm kind of on your side, but that's crossing the line. Wow, Morita. Wow, what a skeevy creep you are. But fine, I accept, because I have a faithful retainer in my captain, and he'll never let me down. Right, Captain? I... 
I don't agree with the faithful retainer part, but I'm not gonna lose on purpose. I won't, I won't be able to progress if I do. Ha! Ah, dream on! I ain't gonna lose this match. I got my strongest gunplay together, and I'm gonna bust you up real good, Sparkle Princess. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. School superstar Shion Daikuchi meets Shogo Morita from Shield of Laplace in a high publicity, high stakes battle. With pilfered parts bet against creepy coercive cosplay, it's a knockdown, drag out brawl without honor or justice between the paradigm of purity and the violent vandal. Get ready for the sweet song of battle, everybody! Gunpla battle! Ready? Go! I was just- I just got a glimpse of the field in the background. What even is the sport that that's painted for? Like, I saw... Like, a football net. But what else? Does it double as an American football field? Are those- those aren't the same size. It'd be kind of cool, though, right? You have, like, a regular football pitch smack, at, smack dab in the middle of an American football field. Is there, are there even sports clubs in this school? Everything revolves around gunplay. Like the education, the extracurriculars. Seems kind of weird. For there to be a sports club. Okay. Let's get through it. These these ones are a little bit more exciting than the cooperative ones. Shut up. Let them take care of all of that. I level up my mobile suit. Defensor. I kind of went the NTD. It gives me kind of a boost to my stats. Makes me a little bit tougher. Alright. No NTD, but whatever. Hey, there it is. Perfect timing. I would like to target a neutral unit, please. Oh my god, the targeting system in this game is so bad. <laughs> Ouch. Alright. Ah. Oh. This is my specialty. High gear, let's go. Woo! Ow, what the heck just hit me? <laughs> Something just exploded in my face. Alright. Boxes, boxes, boxes. Uh oh. Oh, missed again. Ouch. There we go. Destroy a straight gold frame. Is that one of the ones I'm looking for right there? No. Wait a second. Let's go down here. Aha! And the fire rate on this gun is not great. Also reloads extremely slowly. Go. Sure, double Zeta. Right, destroy 20 units. I think we need to complete that one. And it should give us the boss. After we beat the boss, we can beat up Shogo. And that'll end the mission. Let's see. Yes, neutral force. Let's go. Come here. Who cares? 
My goal is to complete only the bare minimum of missions and be done with it. Oop, oh, and ammo. Okay. Go. How many more? Seven more? Oh my god, what's happening? Aim at the wrong thing, dang it. Oh, jeez. No. I just want to fight uh, neutral units. Oh, gosh, my parts. Me arms! Okay, let's just grab this then. Thank you. Let's see, where's our box? Ouch. Ouch. There it is. There we go, got that. Stop. Alright, now we have to fight the boss, and then we can kill Shogo. I mean, destroy his gumbler. Guy's a creep, but I don't want to kill him. Char Asdemol Zaku 2S. Hold on a second. I don't know that I've seen that before. Where is this thing? Oh, wrong way. <laughs> is that it? Apparently so. Okay. Now let's actually fight the boss. Finish this mission. We would have to royally fail in order to lose this fight at this point. Just to make sure that I actually get these, just to see if I've had them before. Go away, I don't care about you. Do that for no real reason. Let's do it again. Ugh. Okay, boss time. Come on! Keep going! Ouch. I will not recover three parts. Oh, finish- Ah! Where the heck is my backpack? Ay! Oh no, I lost my chest parts. Where the heck do those go? Alright, Shogo, where are you? Go, is that you? No, it's a cubelay. There he is. Nice. All right. Oh, yeah, how's it going? I am tired after a long week of work, but I'm doing okay. This is the last round of this game, and I am ready to be done with it. It's also the worst route of this game. And I am in immense pain. <laughs> oh. Alright. Also, I'm trying to voice every character, so... Be prepared. Uh, a big important victory. All thanks to you, Captain. I'm the Captain, by the way. I hate it. 
You bring honor and glory to the Principality of Xion. Wow, Xion was really good. I had no idea she was that strong, did you? Eh. No, Morita isn't very highly ranked, but he had a lot of strong stolen parts, and even so. Morita, I want you to reflect on your wrongdoings, and go on to live an honest, just, just, beautiful life. Okay? Yeah. Uh, fine. Makes me, might makes right. I lost, I got no choice. I'll give everybody back the parts I stole. Then I'll be okay, right? That'd be super. I know you once had a pure love for Gumpla in your heart. Even now, I can feel the love of Gumpla returning to you. That pure, innocent feeling. Wrongs being righted. This is proof of the justice of the Principality of Xion. Ugh. So from this day forward, Morita, you too will live as one of my beloved citizens. You can just feel the evil aura radiating off of those words. Uh, what? My thoughts exactly, Yui. <laughs> what is that? The Principality of Xion? You mean like... But anyway, I'm already on Shield of Applause. The Principality of Xion is founded on assembling the school's cream of the crop, its superior stock, to live by Xion and for Xion. If you're not familiar with Gundam, Principality of Xion is a play on Principality of Xion, which are the sort of Nazi parallel faction in the original Gundam. So yeah, that just you can interpret off of that. Don't you want to be Xion citizen? I don't. Uh, yes, yes, please let me in. Shogo, no. Yay, the Principality grows with another excellent citizen, just like the captain. I'm not part of this, I refuse. And we'll go further still. Won't say it. <clears throat> Shogo, no! Oh, you poor fool. Yui, is it just me, or is this turning into a case of giving an inch and taking a mile? I'm sure she has some kind of plan, I think. Right? So let's wait and see a little longer, okay? Oh, Yui, you're so naive. If you insist. Oh... Uh... Shogo. You were a creep, but you didn't deserve this. <laughs> I'm not so sure about this. Me either, Yori. Goodness gracious. Scenario 3 done. Alright, Scenario 4. Entering the Principality of Xion. Side 0 and the Principality of Xion have routed Shogo. But why are non-members flocking to Side Zero's club room? Because they've been brainwashed? Because Xion has commandeered our space? Ah, another day to bring about the glory of the Principality of Xion. A-A-O. Hey, Shogo, please, go home. Get some rest. I understand why Xion is here, but Morita too. Do you think this means he's come to accept Side Zero? No, I think he just wants to see Xion. Oh, come on, don't be like that. Let's be friends, okay? Ah, this is giving me a headache. You and me both, sister. Marika, you say something too, would you? Marika? Her first freaking appearance. Best girl's first appearance in this whole thing in scenario four. Uh, just another reason why this scenario is the worst. Marika, you've been glued to your phone this whole time. You really have that much chatting to do? S sorry, uh, I, um, my mother, uh, isn't feeling well, so, so, uh. What? Is she okay? Go, Marika, it's okay. You should get home right away. Yeah, uh, okay. Um, alright, see you, uh, tomorrow. <laughs> hmm, you think Marika's mom's okay? I hope it's not serious. 
Or do you think her mother was really sick at all? Huh? What do you mean? Ah, um, sorry I'm late. My mom, um, got a pretty bad cold, uh, so she couldn't taste anything, so, er... I think she has COVID, Marika. <laughs> uh, you're lying! But what Um, what? What? <laughs> you must be in some kind of trouble, Marika. You're not the kind of person to just lie for nothing like you know her. I want you to tell us what's really going on. Uh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not lying. Um, uh, my mom is still, um, sick, so I, uh, I have to, um, I have to go to day two. Bye. Oh, Marika, wait. What's going on with her? We'd be happy to help if something's bothering her. Let's follow her. I thought something like this might happen, so I put a bag of scenery powder on her back and rigged it to spill a trail behind her. <laughs> okay. That is... Leagues better than what she does in the first scenario. Or the first, uh, route. The stuff you use as the ground in di as the ground in dioramas? Oh, wow, Iori, that's impressive. And a little frightening. Hmm, looks like she's in here. That's the second Gumpla room. I think I've said that every time we've had this particular line of dialogue, I have flubbed it. That's fine, whatever. Amazing. They've got all the latest Gumpla building equipment. An expensive brand new battle system, and who knows what else. Ooh, with such amazing facilities, we should conquer this place as a stronghold for the Principality of Xion. Warmonger. Does that mean you want to join my team? Yeah, you're... Shimon Sakaki at your service. Leader of the Shining Elite Team, Golden Cosmos. Shion Daikuji, idol of all the school, joining my team would be quite the amazing development. With my economic power and your popularity, Golden Cosmos could potentially surpass even the student council president's own team, Laplace Nest. Don't you want the entire school in the palm of your hand? Nope, not really. She already has it. Hmm, I thought you'd be more... Made of harder stuff, Daikuji. Well, you leave me no choice. I'll have to defeat you in Gumpla Battle. Then you'll have to listen, won't you? So if I win in Gumpla Battle, I can use your facilities? Yes, we'll do it. We'll battle you and we'll win. <laughs> you think it will be that easy? I have all of your data leaked to me. All of your data leaked to me already. All thanks to little Miss Sakurai here. Marika, why? I think it's fine. Anything that subverts the principality of Xion is a win in my book. A simple transaction, that's all. The Ith Club room was to be demolished for budget reasons. I'll let that sink in. They were going to demolish a club room. A room inside of a building in a school. One room. Specifically. Ugh. Everyone agreed, but I alone dissented. If it's a problem of money, I said, then I'll pay it. Sounds efficient? Yeah. Very efficient. Thanks for being here, Doc. I need all the support I can get. In order to borrow Sakurai's talents for myself, her skill in battle is next to worthless, but she's quite the excellent builder. So she's working for my team, building our Gumpla, in return for my not destroying that moldy old trash dump. And in the meantime, giving me intelligence on side zero. That's no different from extortion! Marika, come here! Hey, did you not hear me? You know she's a traitor, right? She's best girl, she can do whatever the fuck she wants. Wrong! Marika isn't a traitor, far from it! You don't even know her, lady! Shion? Marika fought for freedom, with love and joy and courage. She fought as a citizen of the Principality of Shion. No. 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 
Your evil ways are a crime against the subjects of Xion, so, and so I will punish you in battle. Let's go, Captain! Don't call me that. Absolutely. It's play on a boombox that begins to play Welcome to My Nightmare by Alex Cooper. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. Me either, bro. But I accept your challenge. Let's battle. Golden Cosmos! We'll get your popularity to use our for ourselves one way or the other. Let the battle begin. And where there's a battle, there's the Broadcast Club! A strong new foe appears to challenge the talk of the school Side Zero to another white-hot raging battle. In this corner, if money talks, he's the loudest guy in school. Leader of Gumbre High's most extravagant, expensive team, Golden Cosmos, Shimon Sakaki. And in this corner, super school superstar idol, Shion Daikuji the Devil. This the takes the stakes are high, I can speak. With Shion's superstar status wagered against the second Gumpla Club's cutting edge equipment. How can you not do an announcer voice for her? You won't be able to take your eyes off eyes away as gleaming gold meets the sparkling songstress. Gumpla battle ready go. Ugh. Having Marika as one of my AI partners really softens the blow in this particular one. I have best girl to offset worst girl. Ugh. Yeah, we're just trying to bust through these as fast as possible, get it over with quickly. And then I never have to play this game again. <laughs> Load! Golden Cosmos. Shimon Sakaki and Golden Cosmos are here to win! Alright. Woo! Go, 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 go. Okay. Question is, will... The enemy team single me out. Yep, here they come. Ah, ah. That's right, chase me. Chase me while my friends, or rather my friend and Shion, uh, complete the quest. Uh, looks like they gave up. Okay. Ouch, never mind. Ugh. Bruh, come on. Leave me alone. Stop! Ah! Ah! He is still on me, my goodness. Hi here! Woo! Oh, there goes High Gear. Alright. Super Vern, your high output. Oh, he left. Nice. How do I only have two of my skills? Oh, because I've already used those two. He is still here! Oh my god. This is ridiculous. This is the longest and one of these AIs has ever followed me before. They usually give up at some point and start doing quests. Ah! You don't need to do this. Ugh. We're on opposite sides, but I don't necessarily disagree with your antagonism of Shion. Ah! Whew. He's still coming. I guess on the bright side, this lets my uh, team members complete these quests completely with advantage. He's coming back! This is genuinely hilarious. Uh oh. 
Big Zam. Where is it? Oh, hey, Big Zam. Ouch. 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 Alright, I would like to target the boss, please. Uh-oh. Well. Ouch. Up, oh, dead. <laughs> this is fine. Okay, less fine. Woo! Super speed! Who cares about the quest at this point? Oh, oh no, I want to target the boss, please! No! Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Target, target the boss, target the boss, target the boss, target, do it! You hear me trying to move the stick. There we go, there we go, finally, goodness. Oh my god. What? Come back. There we go. Sakaki, where are you? Come back here. Wait, that was him. What? Wait. Is it, what the heck happened? That says five, but he's number four on the map. And it's over. <laughs> This game is so broken, I hate it. <laughs> I mean, I do love the jank to some degree. But other times it's just ridiculous. <sighs> Impossible! Impossible! How could my strongest fully customized Gunpla lose? Because the difference between our Gunpla isn't their specs or their firepower. How many thousands do you think I spent on this Gunpla? The original model, the materials, all premium quality imports! And my equipment! I should never have lost! It doesn't matter how amazing a Gunpla is if the person using it is an arrogant big-headed jerk. And if that isn't the pot killing the kettle black. Arrogant? Big headed? I. So I can spend all the money I want on the best gunpla, but I myself am unsuitable to battle with it. You built a fancy arena but forgot to book a singer. Exactly. The gunpla user is the one who sings its song. Alright, that's an analogy, I guess. I've. I've strayed from the path of the Gumpla Builder with my dirty, unfair ways. Sakurai. Huh? I'm sorry. <gasps> I swear that as of today... Oh, that was a word. As of this very moment, I will turn over a new leaf and start anew as a citizen of the Principality of Shion. No! That's the wrong direction. Good. Wait, what? Oh. Oh. Another one has fallen. Yay! The Principality of Xion's population grows again. And we all got we got all this amazing equipment, too. Let's keep up the good work, Captain. No. You will fall one day. We're still trying to beat the student council, right? We are, Yori. I don't know about Xion. In fact, I do know about Xion. She doesn't give a shit. Scenario 5. Xion's heart. As black and shriveled as that thing is. Side 0 and the Principality of Xion have conquered Sakaki. Xion fortifies her stronghold for war against the council. What do you mean, her stronghold? Ugh. Are we just hanging out here now? Do we just abandon our club room? 
Xion, the club room renovations are complete. From now on, this place will function as an excellent base for the glorious principality of Xion. Ugh. How far have you fallen, Sakaki? Thanks, Sakaki! This is a big step forward in our mission to overthrow the student council. Nope. I'm not gonna say it. We really just invaded and conquered the second club room. Is that, you know, right? Well, um, if Sakaki says it's okay of his own free will, is it his own free will? Doubtful. It's, uh, fine, right? Probably. <laughs> but, 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 what do we do next? Frankly, I feel like we've got, I feel we've got a lot of momentum and can roll right through the student council office. But... I think that would still be a little difficult. The student council, Laplace Nest, is the strongest team in the school. We need a few more wins to fight them. Rumor has it that if you want to challenge the president and are deemed unworthy, you're not just turned away at the door, but expelled from the school entirely. The student council has the ability to enforce these rules. In this Gumpla High School. Is that so? Hmm. But exactly how many more wins do we need, I wonder? What about, um, getting to single-digit rankings? For what it's worth, I'm currently ranked 10th. Getting any higher than that, it becomes extremely difficult. You'll have to shoot for a duel with the leader of Laplace's nest. Or, perhaps someone like Airbrush of Zeta. Is that... Yo, is Ayoli here? Oh great, more trouble. I mean, she says trouble. But Chinatsu is second best girl. Who are you? Who gave you permission to enter Principality of Xion Outpost Number Two? Prince? Uh huh? Did they move the principal's office? Isn't this the second club room? Welcome! Wonderful to meet you. I'm Xion. Are you here to join the Principality of Xion as well? Please no. Run, Chinatsu. Get out of there. Oh. Are you that Xion from the principality thingy? Principal thingy? Oh my god. Oh my god, I have never seen you this close up before. I'm Ioli's BFF Chinatsu. Call me Chinats. It's seriously awesome to meet you. Hold on, can we talk about the BFF for a second? It's seriously awesome to meet you too, Chinats. So what brings you here today? You look like a girl with a problem. Oh my god, how did you know? Are you a new type? You're exactly right, I got a problem I need help with. So, I love decorating Gumpla, right? Gundazzling is life. But lately there's this team that's always complaining about my designs and hogging all of the painting equipment. Their name is, uh, Hairbrush? Do you mean Airbrush of Zeta? Yeah, them. They won't stop making fun of my decorations and won't let me use any of the paints or tools. They're the worst. I just want to gun dazzle in peace. Ooh, what excellent timing. My team and I are just take talking about how we plan to challenge that team to a battle. Um, we were? Mm, something like that, I guess. Don't worry about a thing, Chinats. Shion and company will make it so that you can decorate to your heart to your little heart's content again. Right, Captain? Oh my god, why would they even give me this option? Ugh. Ugh. Jesus, might as well spit in my face. Uh, sure. Captain? Hey, you're the leader of Side Zero. What are you on Shion's Royal Guard? Oh, that's the wrong one. <laughs> I thought I was reading Shion. Hey, you're the leader of Side Zero. What are you, in Xion's little guard? That's right, the captain here is Xion's most loyal subject. That's a lie! Okay, from the top. All right. We're off to Airbrush of Zeta's club room. <sighs> da 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 Xion has arrived to see you. Sorry to keep you waiting. What the? Ooh. Look, I'm busy weathering these parts. Go back later. Wait, Shion Daikuji? What are you doing in my club room? Are you Masami Shiroi, leader of Airbrush of Zeta? I've got something to tell you. You do? With me? Is it... Do you... 
could it be? Please let Chinas use the painting equipment. What? <laughs> wow, they really filled in that line of dialogue, huh? Wow, fastball right down the middle. You don't waste any time. That's all you had to say to me? For our sparkly rosy future? My pounding heart? Um, well, she belongs to everyone, so sorry, no romantics here. No. No! My pure, innocent heart! And getting rejected graciously is even more infuriating! This feeling, this inferno spreading from deep in my chest, it will never be calmed until I unleash it! Oh, good. That's great. We'll play Gumpel Battle. Shion and her captain will awaken you from the student council's nightmare. But who will awaken me from my nightmare? I've already been rudely awakened from the sweet dream of unrequited true love. And now that bitterness must be cleansed. A uh, passionate storm is brewing between Side Zero and Student Council affiliated pugilistic painters, Airbrush of Zeta. Or at least that's what it was supposed to be. But Shiroi Masumi looks to be consumed in the raging fires of a deeply personal grudge. A battle of the broken heart. Either way, it's a heck of a card for today's battle, and that means Rinko Shakuno of the Broadcast Club couldn't miss it for the world. The Student Council or the Revolutionaries, and what will become of the what will come of the Principality of Xion's secretive maneuvering? It's a riddle inside an enigma. Ready, go! Yeah. Sorry to kick you while you're down, Shiroi, but. You gotta progress through the game. Ah, water. We need to get you a sound learner to stalk her. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Ready, go! Yeah, that'd be amazing. Ugh. I need to get a bunch of Sandler just from all, all from G Gundam, just a bunch. There's so much good stuff in that show. All right, it's time for my patented ring around the pyramid strategy. Where I do nothing for the first minute or so of the match, but break boxes around this pyramid. Oh god, they're after me. Back off. I'm just trying to break boxes in peace. Oh, box. All right. Look, parts. I'll take those. Why not? <laughs> bap, bap. All right. I've already output high gear. Let's go. Oh, too fast. We'll come back to that one. <laughs> Almost to max level. Or what should be max level, considering it's the highest level we can get and still get one of our special abilities. But I missed. Boop. Almost there. Oh, look! A quest built for me. One more. Boom. Ooh, quest cleared. Ooh. 
All right, I need some neutral forces to kill. Cover three parts. I can do that. Hold on. <laughs> Just to make sure that we don't lose in the last second. Perfect. Oh. Why does it target? enemies, like, on the other end of huge groups. Ouch. Ouch. Okay. I just need to fight... beat five more neutral units. Put some pants on Sakaki. Sakaki, no. Ah! Shiroi, that's the guy. Alright. All I do is beat the Dendrobium. No, I want, the, I want the Dendrobium, please. I know what I can do. Alright, high output, high gear. Okay, where's the Dendrobium? That's not what I want to target. There we go. Vacuum, apparently. You can't escape me! Alright, Shiroi, where are you? Is that you right there? No. Where is he? There he is. Get him, guys! I don't know why I shot that way, but it's done! Mission complete. Uh, okay. Oh, two new weapons. Or rather, a rifle and a shield. Uh. It's over. My way of gumplet painting. My love. Why does your uh, way of painting have to end? We wanted to spread our exceptional paint techniques across the whole school. To find an audience, allies, and friends who understood us. But without supporters, the world of art is a harsh, cruel mistress. The more fervently we spoke, the further away students stayed. So I thought... The ranking system that supports the school. The student council authority given to its high ranks. If we had that, our painting would cover the entire school. But, oh. The student council forbade us from paints that didn't serve a purpose in battle. At least realism was acceptable, but stylish paints were banned. What's more, the student council doesn't forgive defeat. They're going to strip Airbrush of Zeta of its special council privileges, I'm sure of it. Well, if they do, Shion will support you. Hmm? What? Seriously? Of course. Now, I'm no art critic, but I can still see that the gunplay you painted are really pretty. Anyone who can paint this nicely can't be that bad. So forget the council. Shion will support you. You... you understand my painting? You're... an angel! I thought I knew the depths of emotion, but I've never been so deeply moved as this! That's right. I'll cheer you on so you cheer on Xion. Oh. So you cheer Xion on as one of the Principality of Xion. We'll change this place into a school of smiles. My goal, the Principality of Xion's goal, is to install Xion as Supreme Commander of GHS and establish a school free from conflict where all are equal and full of smiles. Nope. I would lament the loss of Shiroi, but I think he was gone from the start. Oh, no. Just parading the corpses around. 
Did she say Supreme Commander? Even Morita's on board. No! Or off God! The deep end. Yes. No! God, please, no! no! Please, God, no! No! <laughs> no! Oh, that's perfect. Ugh. No! No! Oh, it's fine, isn't it? It's fun. Maybe I'll join the Principality of Shion too. No, Chinasu, please don't! Oh god, passing students? They're just walking through the halls doing this? This is genuinely horrifying. Like, the current student council is terrible. But this isn't much better. Thank you, everybody. Shion will come through for you all. Shion will never let you down. You know, in a certain way, you could see this as the council being the Federation, you know, Shion being Zeon, but... I don't want to give it that much credit. Scenario 6, Shion's knight. Couldn't be me. It's a body snatcher situation? Oh, for real. Ugh. Side Zero and the Principality of Shion have vanquished Shiroi. I guess he's just dead now. Now, only the council itself remains. But Shion... Ping pong, ping pong. Oh my god. They're not even being referred to as students anymore. What is happening? And just another day at Gumbra High School. The school has definitely changed lately, yes. It may not be quite the change we expected, but... Everyone, um, looks like they're, uh, having fun. Sure, Marka. Well, let's get- it's getting late. Let's call it a day here. We've all got our preparations to make for the final assault on the student council. Also, you know, homework. Really? What kind of homework are you doing at this school, huh? Right. I forgot about that stuff sometimes. Forget about that stuff sometimes. Alright, see you all later. Have, um, a good night. Wow, those that's some weird footprint sounds for grass. I hope I caught you in time. I want to tell you something, Captain. I'm waiting for you in the 8th club room. Ugh. Ah, oh, there you are. I've been waiting for you, Captain. Sorry to call you out here of nowhere. Oh my god, here out of nowhere. You weren't busy, were you? Going home to do homework and actually getting on with your life? Let's keep it short. Oh, you were busy. Yes. Well, um, can I still have a little of your time, please? <sighs> the Principality of Xi'an has gotten so big thanks to you. Everywhere I go, I hear my loyal subjects' happy voices calling out for me. I'm so happy I'm not. Although, everyone is always following me around, so I don't have a lot of privacy these days. Maybe you could calm down. They could calm down just a little. But as long as everyone is happy and smiling, that's okay. It's just, I've had so little time to just talk to my captain one on one like this. Yeah, it's been nice. So today, I put my foot down and blocked out some private time. Some time to just be Shion instead of the school idol and glorious leader. She just really snuck that in at the end there, didn't she? So, captain, should we do a mission like old times? Like the time we first met? I guess I don't have any other choice. I just told her I was busy, and I guess that doesn't matter to her. Big shock. Oof. I am genuinely tempted to just sit here and just let her do everything until the boss spawns, but I feel like that would take forever.
I love that the protagonist's hypothetical dialogue response to that is telling her to take this seriously. Oof. Yeah, every time I stop to take a look at the stage, it, it just gets weirder and weirder in how, like, weird... Ugh, I keep saying weird. Just how detailed it is. Like, all these textures look pretty nice. It's like Travelers... I don't know what that says. That doesn't say anything. It's all just... What are you doing? <laughs> like, some of this looks like it could be language, but... Some other stuff doesn't... It's just, like, gibberish. Ugh. Why make so many, like... I mean, are these high res? Could this be considered high res? They probably look crisper than they are. Alright, we need to destroy 20 more. Ugh. Come on, come here. I need to break you. I need some I need some weaker units please to destroy. Thank you. Come on. Those will go down very fast. Go. No, come on. Kill the little one, please, thank you. Oh my gosh. Four more. Just need to kill four more. One more. Okay. Come here. Perfect great bitch. Convenient. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Nice and quick. Okay. Getting there. That's my captain. She sure knows how to pick him. Ugh. I'm positive we can keep this up with battle skills like that. We'll overthrow the student council. Whoa. We'll over overthrow the student council. Jeez, I'm having a stroke. And officially establish the principality of Xion. Let's not do that. Let's just have a Game of Thrones moment at the very end where it's just. you going down too. That'd be great. So I guess I'll say this now while I have a chance. Thank you for supporting Xion in this incredible journey. Thank you for following me without doubt or hesitation. I've only made it this far because you were with me. I think it's all in your head, lady. As you know, ever since we first met, you've never been just another subject to me. You were always a very special subject. That doesn't... Sa no. So I'll never leave you. I'll never let you leave. Oh my god. 
Would, would you be from now on, now and ever always, with Xion? Be at my side? No. Motherfucker! Okay. That's... Mmm. That's... Sneaky sons of bitches. Okay. I feel like I'm being compelled here. Like, I feel like my life is in danger. I have to say yes to this. Let's be non-committal about it. Oh god, I'm being assaulted. I knew you'd say yes, Captain. I didn't say yes, I said okay. I, I wasn't worried at all. I hate, I absolutely despise that they give you choices to be like, no, I'm not into this. Throughout this scenario, throughout this route. And then they hit you with this double yes situation. Ugh. From now on, give Shion everything you have as my right hand slash lover. That... But at first, for starters, stay with me for just a little longer. Okay, Boomski? No, I'm busy. Did you... Do you not remember the conversation we had just before the mission? Jesus. Anyway, scenario seven. After I was forced into a relationship, she owns Dream. The Principality of Xion, with help from Side Zero, finally launches an, its assault on Senna and Ryoko. See now, they've completely taken over our mission. That's fine, we're working towards the same goal for the most part, but Jesus. Okay, the day of the final battle is here, everyone! I even told Rinko from the Broadcast Club that Side Zero was going to the Student Council office today. The whole school should know by now. I'm, uh, kind of nervous. Just keep doing what we've been doing and we'll be a great. Wow. I'm suddenly having trouble reading just regular words. Isn't that right, Boomski? Let's go win, same as always. That's the spirit. Places, everyone. On with the show! You finally came. Or should I say... You actually came. Vice President Senna? And Ryoko? What are you doing? Don't, Yui. Don't say a word. I'm here as Ryoko Otori, Student Council Secretary. I'm here because of my own unyielding will, just like you. Ryoko. Did you think we'd just let you waltz into the council office? Preposterous. Especially you, Shion Daikuji. Who, me? Yes, you! Why are you here? What exactly is your purpose? Shion came to bring love and smiles to everybody. I'll make the two of you smile, too. That is so sinister. Smiles. Smiles. Ugh. How saccharine. You did all of this for that drive? The drivel. Drivel? Drivel. What a terribly unfunny story. That's not it at all. Shion is here to change this war into a story we can look back on and tell with a smile. I don't think anyone's going to be smiling. At least I'm not. I see. Your attention-seeking and ex eccentricities must also be the real thing for you to have made it this far. I have never been more on this guy's side. But it was all for naught, either way. You end here. At my hand, of course. Don't you ever change, you old stick in the mud. Please don't change, Senna. Let's go, Captain. Today's battle will change DHS forever. What a shocker! The curtain rises on what just might be the Principality of Xion's most serious battle yet. Vice President of the Student Council and the school's number two ranked battler, Daisuke Senna, throws down against Side Zero, featuring the Principality of Xion. That's more like it. That's the way we want that to be said. Power and equality, oppression and liberty, what will unfold as opposing ideals crash headlong into each other. Gumpla battlers, ready, go! That also messes up Ryo, like, Rinko's whole thing. She doesn't just say Gumpla battle, ready, go. Yeah, it's fine that she's, you know, doing her own thing, but at the same time, messing with the reference.
Ugh. Take a sip of water. Alright. Let's go break some boxes. Come and get it. Come and get me. You can't. Are they actually attacking me? No, they're not. Okay. They're not actually targeting me. That's a little inconvenient, but whatever. best that they get distracted by me so that my teammates can do the quests. Let me shoot the thing I want to shoot, please. Oh my god. No, oh, I don't want to shoot. You'll go. Oh my god. I'm gonna be so sad if we lose any of these matches and I have to do them again. No. Five more? That's... Ugh, I don't know if we're gonna win this. <laughs> okay, we got it. Got that first point. That is crucial. I will give this game's gameplay one thing. And that is that momentum is a real aspect of completing these matches. It is super easy to lose just like that first quest and then just get stuck in a loop of almost completing a quest and then having it swiped out from underneath you. I need some neutral units, please. Oh, they're all over there. Interesting. Where's the man cannon? Here we go. Let me go! Ouch. Okay, we have a little bit of time before they catch up to us. Please? more? I swear to god. Cool. Alright. Perfectly parts. That's a little inconvenient. Oh my god. Woo! Can't catch the tall breaker. You're too slow. Awesome. Just firing randomly into a group of people. Get out of my face. How the heck? Did I not kill at least four Cubelays firing into that group? Whatever. Doesn't matter, we're in the lead. Oh my god, come on. I don't care about any of those quests, I just want to get the main quest. Hey, you, come here. 
Watch your parts. A box up here it is nice after recovery instant capture perfect I would like to fight the boss now okay I think the boss is up Sea urchin. All right. Stop that. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, the camera angle is so bad in this position. Am I dealing damage or am I whiffing? What the heck is happening? Come on, come on, come on. Ah. It's almost over. Alright. Where are you, Senna? That's not him. Oh, he's all the way back at the other place. Drop down. Oh my gosh. There's Ryoko. Wait, what? Where is he? There he is. Ouch. Die for me, Senna. Alright. Mission accomplished. Whoa, my god, what just happened? <laughs> I started going in a direction and I couldn't change. Cool. Alrighty. Almost there. Two more matches, I think. Oh. Preposterous! How could someone so powerful have been hidden outside the rankings? Honestly? I was just never that interested. Battle isn't about whether you win or lose, it's about how much fun you're having. Don't be absurd! The ranking system should be meaningless would be meaningless! I worked so long and hard to search for someone that Yuki that the president could battle. Is that what this was all about? All because you were the president's friend? <laughs> That's none of your business. Of course it's our business. Because Shion, I'll turn- what? Because Shion, I'll turn the school into the Principality of Shion. That's a weird line. Equality, fun, freedom, and being able to talk honestly and openly with anyone. It will be a place like that, a wonderful place that- ugh, Worships me. Even you, Mr. Vice President, will be able to talk to the President openly and honestly. You're insane! How can those vapid, twisted words of yours ever, ever change? It will change. It will absolutely change. At the very least, beyond the present, where we sit in silence, never saying a thing. You wanted to reconcile, no? With the president? I don't know what your fight was about. I'm just an outside observer. But I swear, Xi'an will do something to help. I... I was your enemy. Why would you? You're not my enemy. We're friends from the same school, right? That's how the captain and I made the principality so big. I, did, I had no hand in that. Don't you put those things on me. We take the hands of our battle partners and tell each other our dreams. And every time, we think it's all to make this school a better a place where everyone's dreams come true. So will you let me hear your dreams, Mr. Vice President? Will you work with me to make them come true? That's what the Principality of Xi'an is all about. Stealing your dreams and using them against you. Dreams come true. This is the first I've heard about dreams, or... 
Yo, sh she's bringing it all together now. That's right. An interrupting from the sidelines is rude. Don't let her. Don't enable her. Wait, Otori, what are you doing standing over here with us? <laughs> we lost. I'm over trying to be stubborn, that's all. Can you do it? Truly? Yuki and I, can we truly look upon the same world again? Oh, I don't know. Vice President. Sena. Of course. Xi'an will help you. We all will. So come on, let's go. We're off to see the President. If, if I, you can in fact make that come true, just once I want to turn back the clock. Thank you, Daikuji. No, Lady Shion. Sena! Ah! Oh, this hurts. Oh, you were an ally. Oh. Make me, make me into one of the, make me one of the principality of Shion, so that I can face Yuki once again. This hurts. This is probably the one that hurts the most so far. Absolutely! Welcome to the Principality of Xion. Yes. Yes! Thank you, I'm so happy! Oh! <laughs> he was so strong! Oh. How could he have fallen so far? So quickly? Wow, she... She even got the Vice President. I'm pretty sure this is just brainwashing now. It all it was all along, Yori. Okay, here we go. She's a cult leader. To the student council office to make everyone's hopes and dreams come true. But mine most importantly. Uh Alright, scenario eight. This is the last one, but there's two fights. She owns writers in the skies. Ugh. The Principality of Xion comes to the climactic battle, and from there onward and upward into legend. Horrible, horrible legend. The student council office is through here, which will only open to a special officer's only key card. So getting Sene on our side really was useful. Yori Kora, you seem... have you changed? I should be asking you that. Alright, let's go see the president. And then we'll all become part of the legend of Xion together. Ugh. Oh, Kaicho, no. That hurts my heart. Right. Ah, side zero. I've been wait. Uh, hold on. What's going on? What's this huge crowd doing here? Citizens of the Principality, we salute our leader! All hail Supreme Commander Shion Daikuji! Oh, God, stop. They're already dead. You don't... You shouldn't... Oh, this is cruel. What in the name of... Are you in shock? We meet at last, Mr. President. Shion Daikuji. Are you the one who organized this stupid circus? Oh, the President. Oh, Kaicho. Seito Kaicho. You're our last hope. It's not stupid at all. These people have all realized the love of the Principality of Shion. And soon, you'll be smiling with them too. God, this is... It just radiates evil. What? You know, in a way, I actually feel bad for him. No, he is the last bastion. Kinda, yeah. Uh, okay, so in other words, you wanted to defeat me and seize control of the school. Oh, don't put it that way. It makes me sound so greedy, like I am. But if you want to change an organization, you need to make it to the top, so... It's very sad, but this is the way of the world. But don't you worry, true happiness awaits you once we proclaim the reign of the Principality of Xion to strengthen this Kool-Aid. 
We'll even find a way to cure you of your thirst, Mr. President. There's no curing thirst. Uh-huh. At a glimpse, you do seem completely insane. But you really can see through to your opponent's hidden depths. You said one thing that struck home deep in my heart. So that's your genius as a builder, then. The charisma to lay bare the hearts of others. Charm them. Subdue them. Now I see why you call yourself a principality. Don't put it that way, either. It makes me sound like an evil megalomi megalomaniacal despot. So like you are. He's just saying what you are. Not my intention, I assure you. Why not, Cap? I almost called him Captain Kaicho. <laughs> Shall we begin, Principality of Xion? I want to see for myself which of us is truly strong. Wow, you sure are enthusiastic. You might even beat me if I were alone. But... Shion has everyone from side zero, from the whole school. She has her beloved captain, ugh. so she can't lose. Mr. President, we are going to stop you. I wish we wouldn't. No! Ugh. Ugh. I can turn the game off right now. I can refuse. Ugh. I, I, I don't want to do it. Oh, the pain. It hurts. Mm. Alright, just gotta... Deep breaths. Ah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna bite down on something. Hold on a second. Ah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> uh, okay. Composure. We can get past this. I feel dirty, but we can move on. <sighs> Don't know what. No, you said. Oh, screw it. We'll do it live. Hello everyone, Rinko Shakano here with the Broadcast Club. Welcome to Utter Chaos! I have no idea what's going on! What I do know is, this is the final battle. The President of the Student Council versus Sard Zero, featuring the Principality of Xion. Although by this point, it's the other way around. No! It will never be the other way around. And now, the decisive clash, the one for all the marbles. The Principality of Xion's ultimate Gunpla battle. Gunpla battle, ready, go! <laughs> I feel so defeated. This game has harmed me deeply. The scars of my first playthrough are open. Exposed to the air anew. Salted to taste. Ugh. This is a fight I cannot afford to lose. Side Zero, what a pompous name. I'll make it more appropriate by returning you to Zero. To nothing. You're an edgy douchebag, Seito Kaicho, but got him on your side. I don't, I don't know, it's starting! Oh god! Ah, uh, does it end? How? Uh, oh my god! They literally hit me once, and I couldn't escape. Anyhow, hit the box. Hit the box. Eh. Okay. Oh, we gotta focus. Oh, man, 
really hope my allies are doing their jobs. Ah! Come on. Break the boxes. Oh my gosh, yes. Perfect. High gear, let's go. I wish high gear was lasted longer. Alright. Tank container's broken. Go away. Leave me alone. Stop it. Well, we're currently winning, but... I can... Ugh. Ugh. End at any time. Thank god, okay. No! Come here! Come on, come on, come on, come on. We need more enemies to beat. Come on, come on, come on. Two more enemies? Okay, boss should spawn now. Stop! 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 Uh. No! For the Nightingale, what? Oh, that's just a quest. Woo! Oh my god, I'm gonna die? Leave me alone! Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. I gotta get out, gotta get out, gotta get out. Come here! Jesus. NTD. Up! Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> Immediate death. Does it matter if we fail the quest? No! The boss, please! But to destroy the boss! Did we get that? I don't think we did. Maybe we did. I think we got it. Come here! Alright. On to part two. Phase two of the fight. Yes! Yes! So much fun! That even I can be defeated is... But... What's really the most fun... Is snatching victory away from someone who's sure they've won. You can keep going, can't you? If you want to prove what you say, then come! Try to defeat the real me! Oh, we are going to have so much fun! <laughs> what? This power? This pressure is so extreme. This is the president's f -f final form. Come and dance with me! Don't adjust your screens, this is just how the game runs. Lead me to the world of dreams! What was that noise? Jesus. I don't think it usually makes that sound. There, there are three of the same Gumpla. Is he controlling all of them at once? This, this is physically impossible. Even if it weren't, the lag should make it impossible to control. This is the key to my power. A sense of expansion. With my Gumpla, I have achieved the reformation of humanity! Alright. That was weird. No! Stop! 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 Oh god, oh god, oh god. Woo! Oh god. Oh no! Oh no! Oh 
want to target that thing. The, the neutral unit, please. Ay, ay, ay. Woo! Alright, good, good, good. One more. Nice, okay. Make 10 containers? Easy. Easy peasy schmeezy. Oh god. Let's get a nice solid lead here. Two more, let's go. Oh my god. Aha! Stop, stop, stop. Oh god. Oh god. Uh. They're all on me, guys. It's up to you. Complete the quest. Okay, lead. Oh god. Oh my gosh, alright. Come on. What? That's fine, whatever. Not ideal, but it's fine. Cover three parts, we can do that. Easy peasy. Do the thing. Alright. Awesome. That's failed. Oh, man. Okay, three enemy players. That should be fairly simple. Take all those, thank you. Where is... Come here! Alright, which one's Yuki? Which one's the main... Okay, that's a clone. Ouch. Which one's the real Yuki? Alright. We got it. Okay. Ugh. How can a normal team coordinate so... It's natural! The captain always follows Shion, and Shion always hears the captain's wishes. I do no such thing. In other words, it's true love. Ugh. So of course my team is perfectly coordinated with me. I don't consent to this. And naturally, at that perfect level of teamwork, two are always stronger than one. No. Is that even possible? This... this can't... But then, all this time, I've... Stay strong. Shion Daikuji takes the stage! Ugh. I don't feel good about this. We won, but at what cost? Stay strong, Mr. President. Somehow, getting beaten so perfectly after coming this far, I'm not even mad. That's a lie. You can't fool she on that easy. Ugh, fine. You really can't see through right, right through me. Ooh. I wonder if I had friends with me, would the outcome have changed? It'd still be pretty hard, I think. Like I said, the captain and I have true love. And with that, we can overcome destiny itself. I don't consent to this at all. This is really just the power of psychotic obsession. <laughs> yes, you just might be right. 
I lose fair and square. I hereby step down from the office of, office of president and dissolve the student council. Go on, do whatever you want. What are you talking about? I'm not interested in being student council president. What? But don't you want to change the school? Yeah, but I want to be supreme commander, a true leader to guide and protect your loyal subjects. The student council president can be one of my retainers, don't you think? Oh, God. It's horrible. You would even accept me? Oh, no. You're so generous and kind and... Uh, be that as it may, you're right. If that's the way you're going to be, then I'll lend my strength to your future, too. Uh, what was it again? Like this? Oh. Say to Kaicho, no. Kaicho! <laughs> we lost him. <laughs> He's gone. <sighs> it's over. Humanity is lost. Uh. Oh, God. Uh. Uh. It's horrible. I'm surrounded by idiots. <laughs> I want to be homeschooled. Well, no sense in fighting it now. No! <laughs> well, as long as the school is going to be free again. Yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> Have you taken enough from me? <sighs> Insist on taking my dignity too? Fine, you can have it! Oh, thank you everybody! Let's all build a glorious new future. A beautiful principality of S.H.I.E.L.D. Uh, uh, uh. And that's how it all happened a long time ago. It feels like only yesterday. Yuki was in his third year, so he eventually stepped down, and Shion's chosen candidate, the captain, was overwhelmingly elected the new president. That doesn't seem right. That seems very wrong. So many things happened after that, but the captain was always at Shion's side. Not by choice, I assure you. Uh, 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 every day is misery. Thank you, everybody. Have fun and work hard in your clubs. I am a withered husk. A prisoner. Oh, good. Everyone looks so happy. But there's still so much to be done. Look at that. I even gouged out my own eyes. This is the worst timeline. The future of the Principality of Xi'an is still a long way away. We have to work harder and smile bigger. And someday bring smiles to the whole world. And until that time, stay with me, Captain, forever. As my prisoner. <laughs> but one step at a time. What's next? Unifying Japan? Hmm, I don't know. I think the way Xi'an is now, unifying the whole world is out of reach. Isn't out of reach. Let's go, Captain. Together, you and I will engrave the Principality of Xi'an into history until the end of time. Uh, I don't want to be a villain. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna mute it. Uh. <sighs> and with that, the suffering is over. Oh. Uh. Against my expectations, we had some good times in this game. Marika's root lived up to my memory. Shinatsu's root was also good fun. 
Huey's route wasn't as bad as I remember it being. Even Iori and Ryoko's routes weren't too bad either. They were still pretty middle of the road, as I remembered them being, but... That's good in its own way. Rokoko's route was still gross. And I don't even think I need to explain my feelings on Shion's route. I guess I'll summarize it by saying that that route alone has left a deep emotional scar on my soul. It will heal with time, but not cleanly. It will always be a mangled reminder of this horrible experience. <sighs> but we got through. We made it to the end. And we survived. Somehow. Against all odds. It was hard going. Getting through this last route. We lost some good people. But as long as we're alive, we can move on. Seek brighter pastures. We can escape the horrible shadow of the Principality of Shion. Ugh, we might need a lot of therapy. But we'll get there. Ugh. I wish I'd prepared some kind of sorrowful music, maybe, for this last bit. Because the music for the credits is playing in my head. My headphones. But you guys all only have me sitting here Lamenting the experience. Ugh. Alright. And with that, New Gundam Breaker is finished. That was the final route. Well, I mean, technically, Rokoko's is the final route. But we saved the worst for last. There are technically these Scenario Zero stages, but they're not really story stages. So the whole point of this game is to collect parts by breaking them off of neutral units and enemy units. Collecting them, either putting them in the box or finishing a stage with them, and that adds them to your collection. Uh, the problem is, for the most part, it's random. You can't really select enemies to be put into a stage and then try to grind for the parts you want. You have to just hope that the suit that you want is on that stage. These are for each of these stages has you going for a specific type of part. So like Yui's, you would get only arms. Yori's you get backpacks, Yoko's you get shields, Mark and legs, and so on and so on. Ugh. So yeah, not really story missions, so we don't really have to worry about them. There's also event missions. These are... For one, I made the mistake of pre-ordering this, so I got this Super Fumina quest. Uh, you can only do this once a day, which is ridiculous. They wanted this to be one of those, like, games-as-a-service scenarios. But it didn't really work out that way. They, they supported it for a few months after its release. Shockingly. You'll notice that I, I've asked all of these. I've, I've gotten all... yeah. But basically, each one of these... Each line, I guess? Maybe each stage was released every week? And each one of these has different themes, but really it's all for getting 
It's parts from specific suits. The thing that is really mind-boggling about this... You see all of, what, four or five stages in the story? But there's all these other stages that we don't see. There's like four extra stages that look unique that would break up the monotony. But they don't use them. They only use them for these event missions. It's absurd. But that's it. That's the end of New Gundam Breaker. That's all there is. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, we've made it out. Beaten but alive. I, for one, am happy to never come back to this game again. Maybe someday in the far future as a joke. Who knows? But for now, I will celebrate the end of this game. Eh. Not that. There we go. <sighs> Without further ado, this court is adjourned. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. Have a good one, everybody. Bye-bye.